We're gonna solve each of these equations and the main idea, if you see an equation that has a fraction in it, a really great first step is to multiply both sides by the denominator because then the fractions will go away. This particular one has a W in the denominator. So what I'm gonna do is multiply both sides by W. When I do that, on the left-hand side, the W's are going to cancel. So this W cancels with this W, and the only thing left is a nine on the left side. So let's bring down that nine, and then bring down the equal sign. And then what I have on the right side is six W. Finally, um, our equation, we don't have fractions in it, so I wanna get rid of multiply by six. So let's divide both sides by six. W is now by itself. This fraction here, nine over six can be simplified because three fits into both nine and six. Three fits into nine three times and three fits into six twice. So our answer is three over two. If your original equation has a variable in the denominator, substituting what you find back into the original should be done because you wanna make sure that that substitution doesn't lead you to dividing by zero. If it does, you have to throw out your answer. But in this particular, this is kind of an introductory, so right now, I'm not gonna check because I know that they're all gonna work out. So let's go ahead and just quickly solve this one. We see a fraction, so we immediately multiply both sides by the denominator, and the denominator in this one is u. So multiplying both sides by u, I'm gonna have this u cancel with this u, and the only thing I have left on the right side is a negative seven. Let's bring down the equal sign. And then on the left side, we have u multiplied by negative five. So to show the multiplication, I'm gonna put the number and then the letter. So I have negative five u. To get u by itself, I'm gonna get rid of multiply by negative five by dividing by negative five. What I do to one side, I do to the other. This negative five gets rid of that negative five. So I have u by itself and a negative over a negative is a positive, so my answer is seven over five.